What's up everybody, welcome back to Meathead Gaming, my name is Ronald, this is the best channel that nobody watches except a few special people like yourselves, and today we are striving to make Rome great again, in my 1180 uh, Total War Rome 2 campaign. <sighs> okay, so, we set a foot on Italy, Itali Italian ground. Um, my army is sick, which is not good. So, I will probably focus some money to increase the familiarity or the hospitality of this region to my army. Um, yeah, if they come, no problem. So, uh, in another twist of fate, the pirates are at bay. Or at least they are in my dreams. So I'm gonna get a new army here and just use it to defend Greece from the pirates. And then I have to take back. I have to take back. I'm curious because historically speaking, as long as uh, the Saracens uh, held uh, Crete, there will they were always uh, raiding. Pirates were always raiding Roman lands, right? But once uh, Nico, Nico, whatever the Macedonian general turned king uh, conquered this land for the Romans, reconquered it. Uh, the pirate incursions were um, significantly uh, lowered. So we'll see if we'll see how historically accurate this mod is. I'm curious if I, for example, when I gonna take back Crete, if there's still gonna be a problem with the pirates. But for now, what I'm going to focus on is getting back roads. And then, uh, I'm very much tempted to fight it out with Edessa. Uh, they're a pain on the butt cheek here. They are a constant threat on my borders. Because if you can look here, everybody else is happy with me. Um, so if I take them out, first off, the Emirates of Aleppo will be happy about it. And then that's another border. Then everybody will be green. Uh, except Antioch. But Antioch is of little concern to me. We're not on good terms, but... I don't think they're gonna attack me. And if they do, well then... We're gonna adapt. But for now, I don't have money. I need money, so let's end the turn. Let's end the turn and see what happens in Italy. And... In the upper side of Greece, in Epirus. Let's see if these clowns are gonna push further. Faction destroyed. Commune of Milan. Arabian Riders. Research complete. Norse Pirates. Pirates have been seen in. Oh, they're so far away that I don't care. Okay. Attrition. I know, I know, but we're gonna have to hang out, hang in there, gonna get some mercenaries, I'm gonna need, we have pikes, we have archer, yeah, maybe some swords, do I have some swords, oh my god, they're so expensive, what's the upkeep like, oh my god, 800 guys, 800, okay, we're gonna wait with that one, Right, let's see what I can do in Italy. I don't think I can do much. Okay, there's okay, this is this is a good a good scenario for me. Um yes, let's see what I can do for money. How is the situation with the um banditry here? Five percent corruption is not that high. Um Can't remember which one is the best out of all these. Plus eight banditry, minus eight public order. Okay, uh, downside down. Like disadvantage size uh, wise, they're all the same. So let's see the advantage. Wealth from manufacturing, plus six hundred gold, one fifty, plus thirty percent from commerce, 
plus 20% wealth from agriculture, which I do have two farms, so wealth from mining, wealth, I think, I think this looks decent. This also looks good, but I am thinking over on the long term I might make more money with a dish maker. Dishes marker. Dish what? Dishes maker. Okay. Dishes maker. Fine. Whatever makes you happy. Let's do a orthodox parish so that we can lower the banditry. And then let's upgrade one of the the farms plus three army replenishment and nine food this doesn't give me army replenishment i mean realistically speaking i don't need army replenishment in this region so i think i'm gonna go with uh with a herding ground so let's go with the herding ground okay and you shall receive some more units just go into thessaloniki uh we're gonna okay maybe not yeah, maybe next turn I'll get a couple of horses in here. A couple of horses. A couple of pikes. To deal with these Saracens. Right, uh, so we are replenishing the Viking army. Which is good. Then we have roads under siege. They're at full strength. Their army is not very... Do I have to siege? No, okay. So it's an open it's gonna be an open field battle. Interesting. I'm gonna wait. You are currently not researching any technologies, okay. Let's see what economical provincial no provincial okay. Plus one tax rate, minus one morale, okay, minus one melee defense for all units. Mercenary upkeep costs. Yeah, maybe not. Ooh. And that's gonna be in 16 turns. 1,000 1, wealth per turn if you control the city of Roma. That is actually quite awesome, but not for now. What else do I get? Rank for spies. All of them kind of give me the same thing, which is interesting. Okay, let's see. Minus 10% for recruiting mercenaries might be a good addition. So I think I'll do that because um, as I expand, I will need more mercenaries. I don't have any agreements with Odessa, do I? No, only war. Okay. I'm guessing I can't get any auxiliary. I mean mercenaries. Um, I don't think they have much. Why am I using you, my friend? Why are you alive? Okay, what? how much? Military camp. Might be useful to have a military camp here, but don't I have one here? No. Okay, we have one. I think here, yes. Uh, one in Harput would be nice. Hmm. Okay, we'll see. For the moment, money is a issue. But we're gonna take Edessa. Oh, they're having Cilician problems here. Which is awesome. My ally will get stronger and I will also take out Edessa. If these guys don't take it first. Okay, what's going on here? You are defending against the enemy. It's interesting that they show me these guys first. So these are the ones that are going to be... I don't know man, I'm tempted to take this fight. 
I need, I would like, no. I will retreat because I, I want to hire one mercenary. Um, God damn it, these bandits. I want to hire one mercenary unit before I move in. Orthodox Monastery. Yeah, we need to lower that. We need to lower that bandit recount up there. Yes, so I want to hire one mercenary unit. What can I afford? Okay. This is it. So let's go. They have one horse. I have two horses. Uh, they only have javelins and a lot of spears. So. Should be able to outmaneuver them. And my, uh, my swords should be able to cut down their spears. But we have to be quite careful. Uh, I'm not gonna split up the army too much because I get a feeling that they're gonna push in one place in the center like they usually do Rain is good So they're probably gonna come out through here Okay Set up the archers I have a lot of pikes Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, gotcha. I'm gonna fight this melee battle in two lines. I really like the music in this. Kind of like this, because then I will send in the swords in between the gaps. It's gonna be very compact. <sighs> Let's put out the horses somewhere on the flank. I'm wondering. Hmm, I think on the right would be better. So let's go ahead and start this stuff. Where's their horse? Here they are. Okay. They're gonna probably charge. Okay. Very heavy melee cavalry, which means they melee beats. Melee beats shock, guys. Which means. Gotta be careful. Go a bit further, so we are in range. Medium spears, yeah, a lot of, a lot of spears, a lot of spears. Ah, shit! Come on. I'm gonna keep the cavalry close. If they charge in, I will charge in with my cat also. I might lose some of the horses, but my objective is to keep the archers in the main line. So I can get some shots in. So I can get some shots in before uh, they all come at me. I think I'm gonna try to overwhelm the left flank when they come. Resist on the right flank and using the horses and overwhelm the left and just turn into them. Okay, let's see. Let's see how it will go.
at the moment I'm getting free kills, which I'm gonna take. But I still have a lot of units, a lot of units. Quality wise, mine are better. Well, if they don't react, then I'm gonna f speed it up a little bit. I see some movement on the right. I'd like to move up my archers just a little bit to hit the general, but then I risk them charging at me, so let's not do that. These two guys are not firing, so let's move them up a little bit. Okay, now we're, we're getting nice shots into them. They're not reacting for some reason, which is fine by me. Okay, we see some movement now. Killed a few of their horses with my archer. This is kind of interesting. Yeah, the horses are getting shot at nicely. Oh, here we go, maybe. fine by me. Yo, stop, 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 stop. Stop. I'm still gonna have to walk into the city and kill all of these units, so... It's a promising start, and they don't have their general, which is good for us. Units has used all its ammunition. Let's use the horses. To catch their Get out of there. Okay, daddy, let's go. Let's 
think I should go faster. I have the long battles sub mod. Because I wanted to enjoy the battles more, you know, I wanted to make them more tactical. Um, I very much enjoy playing this mod, guys. It's 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 fun. It, I really like medieval stuff, and ex especially on the modern and I mean <laughs> modern, yeah, modernish engine with, of Rome too. Because I was used to my first medieval game was uh, medieval two. I mean, my first total war game was medieval two. Sorry. These guys are gonna break easily. Yeah, they're broken. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Fall back, I told you to fall back. Okay, get out of there. Yeah, go and kill these guys because that's gonna be useful for this general's rank. Um, that's also a good idea to do. Okay, we got the pilgrim archers left with some ammo. By taking out these units, their rank will grow, and therefore he's gonna be a stronger general. I think it's time to split up the troops. I'm gonna send two swords to flank. Gonna send these three guys on this flank to fight their flank. Then I'm gonna leave everybody on pos in position. Okay, you used up your ammo. Good. Good, good, good. So far, so good. Um, let's go fast. Yo, what you doing? What are you doing? I'm gonna try to use uh, these swords to beat up these pikes here. Charging me. At your service. Riders at the double. Forward. Fire your club. Okay, then we'll go for them. Shit done. Let's outflank them. Get the swords in there. Get the horses to charge their cavalry. Yes, I can I can get their back here actually. Get, 
get him out of there. They're breaking. They're breaking. We await your command. How's the situation? Oh, I forgot to send in the swords. This should uh, make the difference here. I move these in units in it's game over gotta use this horse to break them here while I use the swords to face them in one-on-one -on -one battle okay we broke their we broke them on the right Let's get the horses out of there because there's a slight chance they're gonna get wrecked. Yes, let's go baby. breaking here let's give them another charge that should hit their morale yes unit losing decisively okay that's it yes that was nice I don't think I lost too many man 166 okay lost some of this war these horses but they did a. Uh, they were crucial in breaking their middle. I managed to get into them there in the, that little gap and charge them from the back. So I hel uh, helped the main infantry line. I'm very satisfied with how this battle went. Now we're gonna give them a good couple of turns to rest, uh, and then we're gonna march on Crete with this army. I like the purple shield. It looks good. Oh, we can instantly upgrade some things. How is the banditry in this region? Ooh, that's that's good. Constantia. Yeah, public order is not 
What happens if I take them out of the city? Oh, it's still shit. Okay, then get back in. You get more replenishment. Um, what can I upgrade here? Armor. Okay. What do we got here? Interesting. Okay, let's upgrade this army. I wonder if I can afford to upgrade all of it. Nope. Well then. Yes, let's upgrade the archers. And then whatever's left. Yeah, that's it. Let them replenish. We're gonna upgrade them, replenish them. Then we're gonna set them on the next expedition. Uh, I think this is gonna be a more challenging. Yep. They have a little bit more garrison here. Um, okay, let's see what's the situation in Italy. I'd like to have a few more spies though. Okay, first off, let's take Odessa before the Arabs do. Uh, I have to view siege engines. We have six towers, six should be enough. So let's encircle them. <sighs> okay, let's see what happens in Greece, in good old Greece. Can't recruit much, and they're moving out, so this should be my next priority. I will have to recruit some more units in this army. In the next turn, that's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do with all my money. Get some more numbers and then take these guys out and retake what's mine. Um, and hopefully, after I take back Crete, the pirate incursions will be tamed. Okay, these guys need a couple of more turns, maybe. Yeah, something like that. Oh, the problem is I have no vision. I have no vision. Yeah. There is no vision. So I'm gonna sit there for a while. Uh, yeah, let's end the turn. Yes, as suspected. Uh, they attacked Scudari. Now I'm not gonna waste my time with this because it's a little... It's a lost battle. Um, so actually, this 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 leaves an opening for me. Who? Who are you? No, this is my land, man. Nope, that's mine. Okay, as as we said, let's focus our attention a little bit here. How does this work? Byzantine rebels? So... Oh, they rebelled. Okay. Okay, let's get some more men. Let's get one horse. That's gonna be difficult for them. I'd like to get some horses and archers. That would... Help me outclass, outclass the pirates. Right, I need. Can I get a agent here? Yes, I need 1.2k. So, shit. I need an agent here. There's no two ways about it. And then I'm gonna get something else. Gonna get a horse. <sighs> okay. Okay, these guys are replenished. Let's upgrade one of them. This is gonna be the interesting part. We'll see if we're gonna have to. Uh, this is not gonna end well for us if we have to fight those guys. So I shall I shall I shall fight this one out before things get a bit more troublesome. And then we're gonna fight a defensive battle in case we get sieged. My army is pretty decent for a 
siege defensive battle. what we're working with here yeah I don't think I'm gonna split up my army too too much I have a lot of forces but they're not gonna be used a lot so I'm gonna put the archers on this flank I'm gonna close the gap in I'm gonna ah come on put one tower there one here, one here, and three of them here. Let's start the battle. Shit. So only two towers can be set here. Okay, no, three, good. Then I'm gonna put the archers here so they can fire from the flank. Yes. Come on, boys. You are soldiers of Rome. shall accomplish your objectives or my objectives whichever you wanna oh yeah they're getting wrecked here good 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 I'm gonna land on a post here which is nice. Come on, boys. Push the tempo, push the tempo, push the tempo, babe, the tempo. We need to go up there. Oh yeah, they're gonna break soon. How oh, is the ammo situation? So let's fire upon their their general. Oh come on, you're in range. Yo. some units Archers. It looks like they're not gonna fire upon Raymond Dupuy, Dupé, 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 Dupé. So I'm, I'm just gonna, yeah, just do whatever you want.
Okay, I think we got this on the in the bag. There you go. We lost only oh, 82 man, which is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. This is Roman territory. Do not try my patience. Okay, then we shall fight it out. Your horse archers will be useless in the matter. You will fall back. Looks like the county here is open for fun. Now we got a lot of money. Um, from conquering Edessa. Okay, is there anything else I can do? I don't think so. I have to scout ahead. But for that, I'm gonna need to end the turn. I don't want to get it dragged in their wars. Okay then. It shall be so. A lot of horse archers. That's not gonna help them. So let's go. They have five spears. That's it. Two archers. No, six spears. The rest of them are horses, which in a siege battle, you know how useless they are. That's good, that's good, that's good. Okay, they attack on the east. Okay, I'm gonna put the pikes on the walls. Let's put the X-Men also. Yeah. Then we're gonna keep some men in reserves. Two units. Not gonna use the garrison. I'm gonna use these guys and maybe march out of the city and hit them. But I don't see myself doing that because they have a lot of horses. So I'm gonna stay inside the walls and use them to maneuver. Yeah, let's go. Let's see what you got! Put the horses on the fl uh, the archers on the flanks so they can fire upon them, and I put the melees in, uh, in the center because obviously they're gonna probably land their towers around that spot. Now there is a possibility they will burn down some gates, so we're gonna have these swords uh, and the horses to defend in case that happens. Those cataphracts look really good.
stop you fools hit their horse archers Well, this exchange obviously is an advantage for me. So how's it going? Low threat, yeah. Okay, the archers are doing good. Units are winning. Let's get let's get the boys up on the walls. Could also hit the back of these units. Yeah. How about you do that and you hit there? Oh, okay. They're trying to burn down the the walls. Where's the sword man that I sent? Okay, they're up on the wall. Get back down here. Okay, actually, stay there. I need some pikes down here. Let's put some pikes in case they, they march in. Yeah, I'm not gonna chase them down because they're faster, so. Let's just let them be.
General is under attack. Ah, this shit is pointless. Fall back. Okay, we got the spears ready. If they burn down the gates... Get off the wall. No need to take... Arrows for free. I almost want them to burn down the gates. Then I can they can charge in and I can kill all of them. Let's try some maneuvering here. This might catch them. Run away. I'm gonna circle around with the other ones. The gates are down. Good. Our gates are utterly destroyed. Perfect. So let's see if this is gonna work. Oh, they're so slow. They're tired. Shit. How about you just stay here and we fall back? So, you coming in? Come on, don't be a puss. is a good spot now to catch them and yeah, they're not tired as I am as my horses are we're gonna catch at least one of them hopefully oh yeah there you go we caught both of them Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, the bowmen are done so oh, send them home. Fighting goes very nicely here, as expected. Ah, should have done that earlier, but I'm glad I managed to think out of think think that strategy through I know you're tired guys but now is the time for great deeds so what's going on here Oh yeah, come into my pikes. Yes, come into straight into my pikes. Okay. These two units will be enough to do the damage up front.
Yeah, it's time for you to rest a little bit. We're gonna catch them at the edge of the map. Yeah, that's it. Boom! Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, we slaughtered them. We did lose 535 men, but uh, considering the army that we fought, that's okay. Luckily for me, I fought them in a siege battle in an open field. Oof, this would have been extremely rough. Yes, we're gonna give them the knife, as always. And there they go. Off the map. <laughs> Interesting. They are still not pleased. You have my attention. Now, do not try to charm Widow or Kajor. For those, pain is reward. I am in truth and easy, but the Okay, let's start with the West. be able to take them and they are in striking range so let's try our luck oh my god what where out of nowhere yes sure sure sure, sure. of course of course my spy didn't see this army obviously they just appear out of nowhere okay Time for you boys to go. Let's upgrade these bad boys and then land on the shores of Crete. <sighs> we got some cash. I would like to get some more men in this army. Mercenaries would be nice, but they're super expensive, so let's stick. To what's ours? Holy shit! Everybody in one turn! Wow! Okay. Um, we're gonna upgrade Edessa in the next turn. Uh, I could strike down Antioch, but I'm gonna have to gonna have to be be careful about that one. Um, gonna recruit some extra units, let them replenish, recruit some extra units, and then we're gonna march on Antioch. That's gonna bring in a lot of cash. Let's end the turn. You did well. You did well. Yeah, they have a lot of reinforcements. So we shall fall back. Now, let me see you not coming at me now. Okay. The thing is, I cannot attack, for example, Melfi. Because then they will take back southern Italy. 
and humbly request such a thing. No. We have driven too hard. I'm sorry. Our ancestors have spoken, and they have named you as true friends. Do we dare ignore the other world? Just like that, huh? No. Right. So, I'm gonna save up my cash. Auxiliary camp, that would be useful. Let's make a parish, small town. Okay, I need more money. What's the other one? Theater. I'll think about it. Okay, one more turn. We're gonna have the full army. The rebels are increasing in number. Let's see how Hungary is. A flapping tongue that speaks without wisdom is not welcome. I will show wisdom and accept your terms. How kind of you, good sir. Okay, so I think that this turn will be... ...end it here. Damn it. These guys are gonna... Okay, I have to move first. Bring in this guy here. Ooh! <laughs> they really don't like him. Okay. Okay. Uh, what about money? I get a little bit more if I'm in there. So I'm gonna keep him there because this army will be used to stabilize these two lands. Right. Okay, let's end the turn. Oh, I forgot. I wanna. We implore you. Show your strength. Engage this force, and by so doing, put fear in many hearts. How much money can I get for this? Let me see who their enemies are. So back to business. Who are your enemies? Oh, well, you're kind of alone in a big world, aren't you? Kind of alone in the big world. I could get some money if I wage war, but they have uh, they have a sizable force, don't they? Uh, where are they? They were here. They're not anymore. 
County of Edessa. Hello there. Shit. Oh, here they are. We are military allies, aren't we? Okay, so if I attack the now, means that they have to join us, which is correct. So I think I'm gonna do a quickie here. Although I'm gonna lose quite a decent amount of men. Okay. That brought in some good money. Money with which we can do shit. Auxiliary camp here and a military camp on the other side would be of use. Okay, now we have to stabilize the region. Um, shall get rid of these mercenaries. They are not needed. Aleppo is in rebel hands. That sounds good. I could move in. <laughs> okay. Banditry is pretty high. So I'm. Um, what? What do I need? Orthodox monastery. Mhm. Mm okay. Well, let's keep that in mind. I need to lower banditry across my lands. Right, let's move in. We're gonna have a clash of the trash here. Now I don't have a strong uh, infantry line, but I'm hoping to make it up with the archers and with the horses to maneuver around them. Right. Where's the enemy army? The moment I attack them, they're probably gonna be there. No. Hmm. No, I can't do that. What's my relationship with these guys? A good relationship. They're also at war with the Duchy of Apulia and Calabria. I'm gonna build up a second army. Gonna build up a second army here. And lay siege with the weaker army and reinforce them with this. And therefore, we shall be successful. But for that, I need a new general. Oh, these guys are so bad. Might as well get a rival one. Okay, we're gonna get some cheap units. Then we're gonna get those guys. Okay, let's end the turn. We're making progress starting to expand everybody wants to be our ally <laughs> or our enemy <laughs> one out of the two Ooh, twelve thousand no 
gotta do it on your own. I'm busy. Assassination plot. The spy tells you that a politician from a rival party is plotting your assassination. What to do? Demand of Antioch. Antioch leader offers you 12,000 gold for the city of Antioch. He believes that these lands should belong to the pr to principality of Antioch and threatens to declare war in case of refusal. Hmm. Well, interesting. There's a couple of things to consider here. If I give them the city, they will be friendly towards us, which is good, right? And then I can focus on uh, taking out these uh, Arab allies that I got and please my other neighbors and push down into Aleppo and I won't have to deal with this, but at the same time, Antioch brings in a lot of money. But I don't want to wage war with Antioch, Aleppo, and yeah, whoever. Yeah, I'm gonna give them the city. So how's our relationship now with them? Better. Okay. We will gladly listen to your offer. But do Okay, you do what you wanna do. Ready for battle. As I march back. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna get back into the city. Offer these guys um, that I'm gonna join the war against the Shah Armen. Get some money from them also. Um, and so we shall move. Okay. Six turns to surrender. I need more men here. I might get it if I... Yeah, let's lay siege here. Really now? Really? Okay. I'm gonna take these two... Oh, hello there. What you doing? These guys might be a good buffer against the Saracens, but... Oh, come on, this is my land. You keep reappearing. Welcome. Give me money. Ah, that's not enough. It would allow me to focus on Italy, though. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. This agreement is Okay, okay. You get away this time. We're going to get some trash units. Okay, so Aleppo is in rebel hands. God damn, they attacked my settlement. Is there any chance I can defend this? I think there is. 
so we're gonna give it a try. I have some swords, I have some skirmishers, and I have the walls, which is nice. Larissa? What? Larissa? Larissa. Are they attacking me in Greece? Holy shit. Okay. I guess. Okay. That's what you want to do. Let's give it a try. Have some archers. I should pull these guys back a little bit. See how this will go. Yeah, the morale is not there. Not gonna give up though. Get in with the general. Out the gates. Ready for Let's go a bit faster. Let's see if we can achieve. Victory here. Come on guys, come on. With courage. With courage. We shall prevail. Might actually work.
This might actually work. It depends. Let's see. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Come on. Wreck them, stab them, kill them. Where did these guys come from? Oh, it's just one pushing. sandwich them either way their numbers are gonna go quite low theoretically because you never know problem is that on the walls they are beating me Send my general up there. What you doing? Get back up there. Okay then, get back down here. Yeah, I think I shall go faster. Come on, we're breaking them horses. Or not, depending on when you look at it. Our men flee the field of battle. Yeah. This is a safe I think they're gonna win, unfortunately. Ah, uh, these horses should go down easier. I don't think it's quite the realistic take on this battle, but whatever. And uh, now we're gonna lose. But we did put up a good fight. Even on my ass. Okay, it was worth a shot. It was worth a shot, and they lost uh, quite a decent amount of of men. Well, they actually lost like 60-70%.
but they still got the pikes and some of the horses. Okay then. Well, okay then. My master prays that you see opportunity in this conflict, and that's what you need. Darkness gathers. So we got a nice influx of cash. Uh, we did declare war on those guys there. They're gonna charge me. I have three horses. I think I think it's time to take these guys out. Because then I can go back and uh, retake Larissa. Well, okay then. I have three horses. They have one. I have a lot of archers, they have none. So, you know the drill, archers up front. Javelins, the javelins, the javelins. What should I do with the javelins? I think I'm gonna put them on the flanks of the infantry. I want to wreck their flanks. Let's spread this bad boy out. Hmm. Not me, not likey. a couple of horses on one flank the other on the other flank and um, with that we'll have control of the field okay this is the garrison army this is worthless they don't have reinforcements from the flank shit okay let's take them out quickly then Oh, they're not from the flank, they're from behind, okay. Regardless, let's still take them out quickly. try to resolve this problem with the horses when we why do I want to want to keep the ammo for the main army even if this means losing a little bit of of the horses This is nice because we provoked their horse to come out of the hiding. So, we can take him out now. And uh, with that, we have complete control over the field.
Okay, we can go a bit faster. Yes, you are losing decisively. The enemy general is dead. Good. They have a very wide line. might be problematic. Stronger spears are on the right. Okay, you fall back. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna fall back and put them to put the archers on the flanks. They have a very long line. curious to see this uh, the goal is to buy some time with these charges Just buy time. Units has used all its ammunition. Ready. 
Okay, we took out that. That's perfect. We took out those spears on the on the flank. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Okay, let's not use the archers just yet. Good, good, good. Okay, get out of there. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Okay, that's it. Booyah. We lost. Really? 1169 I don't know where that number comes from but supposedly we did now the important thing is that we didn't lose too many archers and horses because the rest of the army was a throwaway army anyway so the quality units are still there um, we're gonna get some good infantries in this line retake the lands from the principality of Dickinson and then we're gonna send this army to Italy. Request for a base on Rhodes. Crusaders offer you 10,000 gold for Rhodes Islands. They need it as a base to improve Crusader logistics. Fuck off. Okay. Now, we did declare war on these guys, so I now have to be careful. Is there any garrison here? A little bit. Get a feeling we gotta invest everything that we got here. There's not much recruitment opportunity. Shit. They have a lot of. Yeah, but they're broken horses. So. Fire the Persians. Okay. 
Okay. Gotta bolster those numbers. Five turns. Right. Now these guys here, why are they not gonzo? bankrupt I humbly propose this in the hope that you will see the merit of closer ties with our king Okay then, I kinda need the money, and there's not much. No warrior like standing alone in battle. Should we not be sword brothers and watch for each other? No warrior like Okay. Okay, they're coming at me again. <laughs> oh man. This is weird. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> There's basically my infantry line is non-existent. But then again, so is theirs. I'm gonna pierce them with my archers and with the horses. Looks like it's the same, same field. I don't think they have any horses this time, right? Oh yes, they do. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Is that so? Might be one of those battles where the archers will have to <laughs> also participate.
general is under attack. Come on, you clown. Break already. Good. Get out of there. Good. units has used all its ammunition. Should charge some of them down. Uh, not attack the other. Um, shouldn't attack. The general. Get out of here. Get back here. Because as long as the general is still alive, I can chase the the units down. And at this point in time, I want to chase them down because that will help me. Um, with the garrison situation. So let's do that. Reduce their numbers to nothing. Because then we can move in for the kill. Um, in the city itself. I think that should be it. Let me just fire upon the general.
Okay. This should do the number on them. There's nothing left. I should be able to take back the city. Hopefully bring in some cash. For my bankrupt ass. Okay, so what I need, upgrade wise, is to be able to get the next level with the churches. Now let me see where I have, because I do remember I had some good churches. There you go. Okay. There we go. Okay. We're gonna replenish the men here. Then we're gonna attack Larissa. I don't exactly know what they have here. That I have there. Oh man, these guys are gonna be a pain on a butt cheek. Is there any units I can spare here? Not really. Well, we are in kind of a trouble. Let's get into Odessa, so we can defend it. Oh, we're not at war with these guys. Then who did they want us to get in war with? Oh, this is weird. They're not happy with us. I will be a patient audience for your speech. Sure that Okay, that gives us some peace of mind. Because then the border here, here is relatively... Okay. I don't need these men here. I'm gonna continue the siege. Let them come at me. In the meantime. Oh man. We have need of talk, I'm sure. But we also need good food, a warm fire, and warm women. What can I give them? Not much. Yes. Okay, let's end the turn. That's gonna be, this is gonna be our last turn. It's gonna be a long episode. But I have some time on my hand and I enjoy playing these. So. Kind of dangerous. No, 
Uh, they just outnumber me so much. That it's pretty hard to fight that battle. Okay, now this is something that... What is this? Oh, this is on Crete. Okay, okay, okay. This shall bring us some money. And hopefully we will get rid of the pirates. With this one. Looks like there's a it's a forest field. Oh but they are attacking me, so they have to come to me. Which means I can chill. Okay, let them come. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Okay, they got no horses here. Could get a charge into them. Let's move the horses into a hidden position. I don't want to waste a lot of my arrows on this garrison force. So let's just charge them with the horses. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Our general is under attack. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Okay, now let's get out of there. This horse general will come in. Yeah, that was actually good. So we're gonna duke it out, kill their general. As my men watch with increased morale. The enemy general is dead. Okay, I'm back. It's 
So the enemy general is dead, but okay. Let's put these guys on the right flank. Fire at will. Oh, not there, you stupid ass. Oh, that was wasted. I don't know where they're going there, but whatever. Yeah, let's not charge that. They're very spread out. It's gonna be useless for them anyway. Okay, the archers are out of ammo. I need to use those horses somehow. Ah, what the heck. Let's try this.
that should solve that problem. Yes, it did. Good. Hit those exposed flanks, come on. Okay, I was hoping for that to happen. For my archers to beat their spears. Now I don't have to worry about them. try to pick up some snacks also with these guys so significantly lower their numbers Okay, the tides of war are turning. Let's go a bit faster. Nah, they're just joking. Let's get a good couple of charges here in the center. Oh, they're done. Okay, we lost 900 against their 2600. What? What is this shit? Okay, at least we're not in the minus anymore. Oh, 
Why can't I march back? That's dumb. Why can't I march back? I can only attack the city. What? What is this? Okay. Okay, let's take this spy. Send them to Larissa. See what's going on around there. Antioch is not happy with us. Maybe I should take Antioch back. Yeah, there we go. Money in the bank. Okay, and I think I'll end the episode here. So three more turns and we're gonna get these guys. Uh, the garrison is non-existent, their numbers are lowered. And we shall be victorious. Uh, then we'll see what I do with this army, I'll keep it here a little bit, just to stabilize the land. Um, I'll probably send it to Greece to take care of Larissa because this army We'll be chasing the pirates. And after we take out those pirates, we're gonna send both of the troops into Italy. At least that's the plan for now. Guys, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again next time. Until then, stay safe, stay clean and always stay strong.